Can you live in Bangkok for £10 a day? Eating, sleeping, everything. Good morning, by the way. Sorry, that was a rude of me, wasn't it? Lawrence is reverting back to his single young self. <laughs> Am I? Oh. Just for the video. <laughs> like, any ideas? <laughs> okay, now we're talking. We're going to have breakfast. That's the first port of call. We're then going to go and find a hostel for as cheap as possible. Then we are going to have some lunch and some dinner. And we've got £10 budget. And we've got to stay hydrated. And we've got to Most stay hydrated right, and travel. I'll start off with this tip. 10 baht for a bottle of water. Four or five small bottles of water will do you fine. So 40 to 50 baht on water. Your best place to eat if you are on a budget is street food. So there's carts everywhere, tucked down little alleys. The more tucked away it is, the cheaper it's going to be. This one we're about to go to, for example, the average dish is about 30 to 40 baht. So that's going to be breakfast sorted. Let's go and order. Do you like something weird? I'll have a fat with chicken. Yeah. I'm gonna have a crapau. Uh, we can get him some rice or maybe an omelette. Yeah. Omelette and rice. Okay, here we go. You can see. Hello, hello. Ah, okay. What's great about this as well is uh, they normally have these little tables and chairs, sometimes little plastic stools, so you can sit next to the vendor, have your food, five minutes, then you're off again. Very quick, very efficient very goddamn tasty. Especially if you're hungover after the full moon party like these youngsters are. The hostel's gonna be, I'm gonna try and get it as cheap as possible. Um, hopefully I can show you around in the room. I'm gonna spend under a fiver. If I can get it close to three, four quid, that's gold. Okay, so I found this hostel online. It said it was two quid. Normally they put the taxes and whatnot on top, so if we can get it for around three quid, and then we go inside. How much a room for tonight? Uh, it is like a mix with a uh, hundred, hundred baht room. Hundred baht. Yeah. Like this one. Okay. 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 The bathroom, yeah. shared, Very shared shower. shower. Okay. Let's clean the toilet. Shower. For a hundred baht, you say, yeah? Hundred. Okay, come. Mixed dorms, 100 baht, which is £2.50, with the taxes and everything else. Um, unbelievable. So we've got another 7 50 that we can spend on some transport, a bit of entertainment, some water and food. It is still possible to travel very, very light in Thailand. Ploy, Ploy Hostel. Look them up. So look, she's dug in already. How is it? Let's just keep it warm. No joke. This is the, I've tried yours as well. This is the best food we've had. I'm not even joking. So this is street food. They've put out a little table and chairs for us. And I was actually having a lovely time. And it has literally cost us about 80p a meal. It looks very, very good. That's the omelette and rice. Ready, you want to see yours? Da, 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 da. The big reveal. Go power. Oh. oh, clever boy. Very good. Very, very good. Perfect spice. Fresh. Herbs are fresh. Pumps good. Amazing for 90p. Genuinely the best that I've ever had done. The whole. I You also need to include waters, which are about 10 to 20 baht, depends on where you get them from. So, it's mid morning, and you want a snack. Just got back to the hotel, putting the little one down for a nap, and ham and cheese toasty. If you've seen the videos before, you know I love ham and cheese toasty. Carbs, protein, fats in one little toasty. 25 baht. It's about 40p and this will fill you up for a good hour or so. Until lunch. Perfect little snack if you're on a budget. You can get these from any 7-Eleven or Family Mart. They all do. Just to have some variation, this is noodle soup with pork or beef, 25 to 50 baht. So we're now on to lunch time. This is lunch. Beef and pork noodle soup. So for one person, Bar. Again, you sit down on the table, you've got some stalls, typical street vending experience. You also get some chopsticks and you've got some sugar, fish sauce, 
some chili, sweet chili, and some chili flakes. I'm not gonna add anything yet, I'll see how it tastes first. I like the thick noodles. Mm. I opted for the pork. For this one, we've got some beef in the other one. That's a bit of a fatty bit. Fatty and gristly. But very, very, very tasty. Obviously where, oh, got the pan. Obviously where you get most of the flavour from in the, in, the, in the animal too. Hold on, there's a, there's a bit of meat there. Yeah, so you can understand why I use this cheap. You've got the cheap, cheap off cuts of the animal. Mm. Those noodles are superb. But very, very flavoursome. If you've had one of those barbecues, the Thai barbecues or the Korean barbecues, when you've got the pool of water around the outside, then as you cook the meat, it drips in and you get this broth afterwards. That's what this soup's like. That's what it tastes like. It's got so much flavour. I'm going to try one of these. I don't know what they are. It's nice though. It's nice. I thought it was going to be, be, be a bit tofu -y, but it's got more texture to that. You get some bean sprouts, a bit of cabbage. Uh, I'm going to put some chilli now in it and uh, enjoy it. So this was 40, 50 baht. So this is again, pound. So we're... I'm going to put the counter up here, how much we've spent throughout the day. Um, but this is just to get you a feel on, you can eat for cheap and you can eat tasty, delicious food. So, for dinner, we are going to be eating here. So this is all street food vendors. Let's have a look and see what there is. Rice with a topping, 35 baht. So here you can see they've got all the different toppings, they've got rice, they've got masaman curry, loads of different things. So that's what we will be ordering. If I want I just got 35. 35 baht. What a bar. So I'm gonna put the total up here how much I actually spent. It was less than 10 pounds. So it's probably between six and seven pounds. So with that, you can also buy yourself a couple of beers of an evening or a couple of cheeky gin and tonics and enjoy your day. It's cheaper than I thought, to be completely honest. 